I just said my clan, Beaver Clan. I'm from the Longhouse, and uh, Hawanagai is my uh, given name. I was uh, working, literally just like five minutes away from the uh, casting call, and I was uh, picking garlic. And someone just came up to me, hey, they're having a movie audition down the road. So I went there and met Mark Ellis, and he just loved me. He was telling me right off the bat that I think we found our chewing. I seen a newspaper in Buffalo, and as soon as I seen that, I knew it was like gonna be a big time production because natives don't normally advertise like that. And I was like, oh, somebody knows what they're doing. You're coming from the attack. You scored that hard thing. You win. We all know each other. You know, some of us played against each other growing up. Miles, Lyle, Cree, Ty, I played with them. Guys like Emmett or Tyler Hill, James Bissell, I played against them for all of us to come from different reses and then grow closer over the amount of days we have here. You know, it's, it's, it's a great experience. It's real interesting because it's my first, first movie shooting, first time ever being on the screen, especially being kind of young. It's nothing like I thought it would be. <laughs> Working with uh, Brandon Routh, Superman, yeah. Chelsea Ricketts, this guy's an actor. <laughs> they found me through a series of auditions out in Los Angeles. I auditioned for Reed as well as uh, Jimmy Silverfoot. I never really played lacrosse as much as the other guys did. They've played from the time they were, you know, yay big. Every second back home, you have your stick in your hand. You're always messing with it. It's like an extra part of your body, it's like your arm. A lot of people just think of it as just a game, but like everything that I know, I can relate to lacrosse. Once we can walk, our stick is in our hands. It's a part of us. Like even like right now, we're not shooting. We, we brought our sticks on the set, we're messing around the stick. Oh, this is not even mine, I just grabbed it. We have to have a stick in our hand at all times. I think the message of the movie is never give up. And um, really, if you put your mind to something, you can accomplish anything. Uh, I think it'll be an instant classic since it's the first lacrosse movie. Kids will probably love it, you know, it's got funny moments sad moments and uh, some serious moments. This movie has taken uh, huge steps as far as portraying the Native Americans as we really are in the history of films as far as having the real information about us in there. Here's a metaphor. You, you always have to take care of the ball when you're playing. You, you don't want to drop it. And, and that's like taking care of your family or taking care of whatever, whatever it is that you hold close to you. It's like you never want to, you never want to drop the ball. You always, you always have it in your stick, and you cradle it. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> that one's fun. Sing it. I heard I Beyonce, Beyonce song. I heard church bells ringing. Ha, ha, ha.